Mr. Ferris, sir. The, uh, the lad in the factory should be taken to be bandaged by the apothecary. Fine. But dock his wages. Yes, sir. Accomplish, boy. A bolt loosened in Starrick's machine. A large bolt, but not enough. Your Grandmaster will fall. You assassins can circle London to your heart's content. The mechanism we have built has been going strong for a hundred years and will run a thousand more. It is the very city itself. We will take London from your hands. From Croydon, you lurk in the shadows like a coward. I doubt it. We seem to have made an unscheduled stop. Yard. Guard quarters. Bruce's laboratory. This is where the piece of Eden will be located. No loose ends. Now, to decouple the locomotive and create a diversion. Well, where is it? Huh? Where's Brewster's supplies? Meter. That should keep you busy while I head into your lab. me down the tracks. You stay here. I'll keep a look at. Alright. I'll shout if I get any bother. I need two more weeks with the device. Your questionable practices are beginning to draw unwanted attention. You have been given more than enough time to achieve results, Sir David. I was unaware that you expected me to perform like a cocker spaniel. Permit me to remind you of your obligation to the Order. Miss Thorne, you ride me like a racehorse. Sir David, I will return tomorrow. If you have not unlocked the device's secrets, forget your dogs and horses. I will leave you to the wolves. Good day. I was merely promised a tour of the premises, my lords. Who sent you? It's one of green spies. Get that man to interrogation. Then I want him brought to the lab. What a pity. But no deviations from the mission. <laughs> 